Down and then washed out. Looking right along the line of scrimmage there. Trying to stretch the play out. Depth the heels and then work down the line and they will come to you. Talk about being over aggressive. Nice job in that instance. Again, receivers two by two, second down and ten for the Bobcats. Fire out to the left side, going to be caught and brought down at the 13 yard line. We'll see where they give the credit for when he will be the 13. So we'll bring up third and three. Eric uh, Bankhead, boy, I'll tell you what, he saw that ball and he timed that perfect. So the receiver caught the ball and it was just bang, bang. He took him right down. So now we got to hold him here, keep him pinned, and then we'll come out of here with decent uh, field position. So you, uh, if you're Coach Noble, you get quarterback. Get quarterback. <laughs> for sure. Two by two again are the receivers for Steel City. 102 left here in this first quarter. We've got back to pass under pressure. And it's going to be wrapped up and brought down in the backfield. The window's going to be Andy Cook on the initial contact. And then a host of uh, Cleveland Cobras, including Harlan Page, would get in on that one. And uh, if we found out with Harlan Page, you might want to get out of it. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what. He saw Page coming, and I think he said, whoop, and sat down, and the rest of them were there. That's a great job. That's what they need to do. They boxed him in, they gave him no lanes, so they got to him, and let's take off. Inside the 10 yard line, coach. So we got, we got Willie James back to return. One of the faster guys you'll see in this league. Take a shot at me. Get down there. Looks like he's left here in this first quarter. This one flying down. First frame comes to an end here in Lakewood with the City Bobcats taking seven and nothing winning for the Cleveland Cobras. So quick timeout. This is the Cleveland Cobras football here on the Super Zero Radio and the iMedia Radio Network. Dave said, I'll be there next week. What's that? Dave said, I'll be there next week. Over the Cobras. 
the kid was on it. What is this kid? What is the shot from the turn of the tape? Is it another ball? Yeah, I think he just melted about three minutes ago. Whatever, whatever. Orson Blue. Orson Blue. Bill Ball. I'll tell you what, that's a big boy. Please help. Have you seen him in here? On a quarterback sneak, get past the line of scrimmage, get hemmed up a little bit, and they cleaned up at the 30 yard line. What else up? What else up? What else up? What else up? I'll tell you what, they're moving some people around. They're just, they're just big up front and they're able to just screen them off and they're looking in them holes. That hole was wide open on tackle. So, and again, they, they just got to keep the ground, stay low on these big guys and they got to wear them out. Start running some twists, or they're going to have to run some blitzes. Because these guys, all they're doing is big on big. And what I tell you, it's big. These guys are just pushing them everywhere. So they got to stay low, or if you're going to fire, fall off and bury. Don't let them get those out. Right Yeah, I'm trying to. I was hoping that this would like let me move up and down, though, but it's not. Hard run. For whatever reason. So I got hold that like a tilt type. Oh, okay. It's not no issue or anything. Oh, okay. Covers were there and stopped him. I mean, it's a gain of five yards. He had a good head of steam on him. That's what you want. So running back, he's a big boy. Check in for the code when the marshal will come off. Yes. Come on, continue to run one fifty-one. Start coming up against this. Oh, hold on. 
Yeah, but they, they, now they still have to be aware because the talk is in Bobcats will do go for it at any point in time on the field because they were in the end zone. And uh, they got that first down on that fake punt, so they have to be aware. High snap! Because what happened was he threw the ball forward. And I believe you can't do that. I believe mean, it's a penalty. I don't think they might have waved this one off. But it looked like it came after the penalty or after the play. The one time he was walking around to play the team, the Bobcats player, were having some interaction. I think you were going to get close to this one. Maybe it's going to be first and ten for the Cobras. At the Bobcat 25 yard line, 855 left here in the second quarter. Oh, here we go. Now we got a smart here. Do your job up front and Russ will come. Because that's it so far. It's been it's been the uh it's the O line and D line that have been under control. Let's do it on the side. Every day we can see it on the other side. Now pitch out to the far side of TJ Jobs trying to cut up the field. You make it back to the line screen. There's nowhere to go. Actually didn't hit the ground, didn't hear a whistle if we hear it now. Some confusion. A good money by the TJ Jones to get up and Yeah, and that's what you do, because I am uh, with you, Jim. I did not hear a whistle. So you gotta do what you gotta do. You don't hear that whistle, just keep going. 830, left here. In this first half, you know what you're doing? Your drops just below the green. Yeah, how about that? Last time we heard we left Youngstown, it was uh, 82, we came up here, it's 72. Got a little cold now, it's uh, yeah. change. Downfield, he's under pressure. And he'll head towards the sideline. That's going to be a late hit. Come on, a late hit on Steel City. And that is a mental mistake by the Bobcats. The personal foul coming up against the visitor. It's going to be an automatic. Yeah, automatic first down. Half the distance. It's a good job. They will take what they give us. So it depends on the spot where they go. So indeed, the official is indicating first down. So it will be first and 10 from the 15 yard line. And I just want to you know, mention that was in the play, and you know, that's that sometimes you're drawing. This has been a clean game. There is not always drawn. But I don't see anything that, you know, all sports can see because it's a lot of people in general. In the case of formation, T.J. Johnson behind him to receive on the deep side. And the other Johnson, Johnson trying to cut back in the middle. He'll pick up some yards. Maybe pick up around five. It'll be second and five. Good job with the center part of the offensive line. They got to their blocks. They got them turned. That's a great job. They're going to hurry up. That's going to throw it. And that's what they got to do. They got to wear this defense out. Just under seven minutes. He kept stringing it out. And here's the thing. Reacher's block. The blocker 
have, and I would say, look for the rear end of your blocker. Wherever his rear end is, that's where you turn it. I don't know why he was trying to go to his outside. It was a beautiful plus out block on that, and he's got it right now. Put your foot in the ground, he cut off his rear end. This is stuff that this is a lot more football. Oh, don't he had that. It was a touchdown. <laughs> well, that's the uh, offensive coordinator in me. I can't help it. And you can't, you know what? You can take the coach out of his field, but you can't keep the football out of the coach. Drop. Under pressure, he's going to be brought down at the 15 yard line. It's going to bring up fourth down for the Cobras. That will bring on Ben Lyons. Well, as a, field goal. as a quarterback, it's one Mississippi, two Mississippis. I better get it out of Mississippi. You've got to get the ball out of there. If you get the two, it's got to come out and make a decision. But you've got to have your head on the swivel. He got hit back side, and that was all she wrote. 518 left here in the second quarter. We will have to flip sides of the field to kick a field goal. Same with the running back, if you cut up the same time. Yeah, he cut it, was, it was yeah, right he had the hole perfect. All he had to do was cut that back inside. Yeah. He wasn't nobody going to catch him. No. Nope. Because yeah. he was right there where yeah. the guy was anymore. Yeah. 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 He, he was pushing him outside. Yeah, he ran right into the. Right where he was blocking him. Yeah. But as they say, they beat them and they come off high and. Prepared for the next game. Sometimes that happens. 32 yard field goal attempt by Ben Lyons. He's at his back. Kick is up. And it is good. So 4.59 left here in the second quarter. Covers get on the board. He had a 32 yard field goal by Ben Lyons. Cobras now trail by a score of 7 to 3. We're going to set aside for a quick timeout. This is the Cleveland Cobras football here. I'm going to show you a video on the top of the media one. Now. First and ten from the 12-yard line from our angle. 
That's the difference between two or something. The trip receivers to the far side of the full Bobcats. So you see the near side. Pass looking for the one on one. Ted Fortune with the coverage. That's going to be caught and dropped near midfield. Ted Fortune reaching in and knocking that one away. Second and ten now for the Hawkins. I just want to tell you, that was a magnificent pattern and draw. He put it over top of everybody into the bread basket. He had it. And then he came down, and I'll tell you what, that's an outstanding job. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Just joining us. Hawkeyes have a 7-3 lead over the Cobras. 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 Again, the quarterback. And uh, try this on him, and that's fine. Don't you see him the far side? Yes, we'll have the one-on-one -on -one coverage to the same side. Pass, pass hard, that's to the other side, going to be knocked away by Harlan Page. He got that big paw in there, and knocked that back into the parking lot. That's something that we all have always worked on. Get them hands up there, cross them at the uh, wrist, and, and give them no lane to throw. And that's exactly what he did, knock the ball down. Now we got further along. Uh, that's that's a great job. Now, but we've got to be smart here. Get to the quarterback, make sure that linebackers are, are spying. <clears throat> but then know where the yard stick is and keep them inside you. Under pressure, ball's going to be caught inside the 30. To the 30 yard line. Fortson looking to bring him down. He'll get out through the 31 yard line. First and 10. For the Bobcats. We're going to take an opportunity to tell everybody if you are watching our Facebook feed. We have several links coming up here. Do not fight it.
206 left here in this half. Pass out to the far side. It's gonna be dropped. That may be a fumble. And we'll see. I would even call that a beat of a backward pass. And it was picked up by the coach. We're gonna have 159 to work with. You can see the running back coach got a little bit of depth as he was trying to get yeah. that swoop pass. And the official. It's going to be first and ten now for the Cobras. That's a turnover. So what the receiver said is, if I hit the ball, <laughs> that's not if it's behind the line, you got to catch the ball. And then instead of jumping on it, as we have all the time, you know, just to be safe, he just kind of stood there. And then that was a great job by a Cobra player. He got after it. Heads up play. Mike Green will get the ball first and ten now at the 33 yard line.
Well, not only that, but 48 seconds, and you give them the job right there to put it down in 45. I would say no. So, come back. You know, you know, you You get this one away. That's going to be the turtle. That's the same turtle that you picked up. Trying to get names off a of name tag and saying, uh, trying to get at least the offensive line. So you got 51 Jones, 73 Price, 52 Jackson, 53 Johnson, who goes both ways, and 53 Davis. And let me tell you what, there ain't a guy out there that's over 280. They are big. Before the kickoff, 
there was a little bit of uh, governing going over with the officials. There was they were kind of around the most of so they were telling them what a great job that they were doing in 20. <laughs> No, they really have not As a matter of fact, I just want to say that we were uh, at the office today and working on a little piece of equipment when John was sitting and his wife came in and got some work done. It was another piece of work as I call them. We're on our way here. Third quarter action here for the James and Bart Evans. Tackling turn to the Evans. On the return, it brings out to 15. Here to 20. He'll pitch it forward to Willie James, the flag will come out. Oh, yeah, the pass. I don't know if that was even necessary. He's just a two coach, but uh, he can't play that one sometimes. One of those special teams, man. Here's the key to this. When you get, you cannot hesitate. You just get what you get. You have to have a view of what's set up. You already know if there was a, a play call because there's obviously you need to You can't just run down the field. So find out where your blockers are, make a decision, and go. Don't put a pat. And that's what made it bad. And then, of course, if you get hit, you shuffle it forward, and that's going to be the And that's the point that it looks like to be. Nonetheless, Coles will start inside there now, 15 yard on the first and 10. This is a beautiful facility. Great little press box for a junior high team or club, whatever they play here. This is outstanding. I'll tell you what, I wish I were in coaching and have this kind of stuff for my junior high. Calhoun and Johnson now in the backfield. Part of being a pistol formation. Calhoun is right down here. Johnson to his right. Two receiver to the far side. Now he's going to be a slot receiver. Boy, we'll be the receiver to the near side. He's got a hand on the Calhoun. He's got a couple of yards. 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 And they're making moves. They're, they're stepping out and bring underneath and it's throwing off the offensive line. They have got to have a nicer base and they've got to engage and get their hips turned. They know where the ball's going and what hole they're going. So they have to turn their hips and then engage and run them out of there. Can't still make. You gotta move these guys. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So Thomas here's the near side for the Calhoun and Boyd. Who's got the back? Who's got the back? Harder now firing out to the flat. That's going to be caught at the 18 yard line. This is where they give him the progress. Actually, they'll give him the 19 yard line. They'll make it a much easier third down. Again, is what I spoke. Now, you had second and long. So they're giving you the slant. Get the slant. Because the backer in the corner on that inside of the shot is just right there. And they've not blocked anybody out, so it's wide open every time. Receiver two lines here. Shotgun. 13 26 left here, third quarter. Coming back to pass, looking out to his left. And he's going to be spotted down in the backfield. And that's exactly what it was. Since we see this a lot happening, yeah, I don't know what they're doing. So thinking about it. Yeah. They have got to then, they've got to do that. He's second guessed himself. Plant and go back to get the first step. Don't go to the road. Yeah. Instead of that, and that's just the excuse. If you fell forward, it would have looked like it would have been enough for the first, too.
type player. He's yeah, so he's, hard. yeah. He's, fun to watch. he's all over the field. I tell you what, his quickness and his size. Yeah, he did a good job. Firing out to the left side. It can be picked off. Good reach over to get it. Yeah, if that was okay, I would take that all day because if he catches that, he's down in front of me about the five, six yard line. So I'm good with that. So let's see what we got. They want to bring the punt. Yeah, fourth down, they want to bring the punt team in, and they're saying no. We want to go for it. Back on ourselves, Zach. Peterson Ball, right behind this one. Well, what I think they try to do is they try to spread them out. And we talked about earlier about the quarterback draw. And, uh, and there was a linebacker there. And when he went through, he kind of hesitated. But the end was right there. And he did an outstanding job. He did a great job. Amazing out back in his day. That was perfect. 
the Lord puts our lives back to you. He's going to want to cap cat you. He's going to chill out. He's going to chill out. First and 10 after the cover is at the block at 30 yard line. 724 on the run clock. That's the formation now. Lee Thompson still at quarterback. Cal Moody to his rear. And Jay Johnson to his left. Stepping back, fires downfield, looking for a man in the corner of the end zone. It's going to be a battle. And he knocked away, incomplete, 7 of 7, left on the clock here in the first quarter. Let's see if we can get a number on that. I tell you what, this Jameer Lofton, they're picking on him. I'll tell you what, they've not got, got anything on this young man. He's doing a great job defensively. Continue to run here, 658. They're also giving the uh, quarterback a little bit more time, and that's, that's, uh, that's a good thing. Receiver to the far side now. It'll be wise. Two shot of cover, receiver to the near side. Now we'll be running back to the left of Thompson. Thompson stepping up to the line for a change a few assignments. 630 up to the Look at the pressure shown at the line. He'll take it himself, trying to get up, he didn't get what he's doing. He's going to lose the yard on the play. That was it. Not bad, but I'm going to give you a pass for a yard of loss on the edge. It's 11. Jimmy Kirk Gordon. I think they were really amused by the way that Thompson uh, was taking the turf. 15 needs to come out, his helmet come off. And he's staying in, so. I'm not going to be able to see him. This one, 
again, uh, who knows what the rule change is if there uh, was a The ball was returnable. Therefore, it's going to be a it's live ball. It's a live ball. Yeah. He didn't jump on it when it went through his legs. Code was dead. That's touchdown. That's got to be touchdown. It has to be. It's like we're going to get a call from the official. We're going to talk to Adam Rogers. I mean, they're going to say, I'm seeing a preliminary signal of a touchdown. I, I don't know about that one, Coach. It shouldn't be. I, I don't know about that one. And, I'll, and I'm not saying that they are wrong, but again, returnable ball. I think Coach famously done by Auburn. Or, or during a championship game when you block a, you block a uh, extra point right back for a touchdown, and that coach was on the field just being so animated, and somebody had to come and pick him up. <laughs> Good times, Coach. Good. And they're going to say it's a touchback, so you'll see Bobcats will get the ball first and 10 at their own 20 yard line. 350 left here. That should have been in the third quarter. Hand it off in the backfield. He's going to almost be thrown down. He's going to escape it. It's just going to get worse. And then the Bobcats are going to lose probably four or five on the play. Well read by the Cobra front four. Well, we got to wrap up. Don't worry about slamming him down. Give him a bear hug and ride him to the ground. Just you know, whip it around. That's, that could have been dangerous because he got loose, but the rest of his buddies were there. So, you got to, got to, again, football's changed. You know, a lot of arm tackle, a lot of that. They can not slam him to the ground. Guess what? Now you get to use an arms. From Dave Ferris Gold and the Green Bay Gold Hawks. 47 to win. 47 to nothing to win. Do you get it out, Coach? <laughs> You're all right, Jack. You're over. It's New City Kings. Hey, football league champions. Pass now. Under pressure. And finally, some more to run. It will be the Bobcats. Most of my jerseys kind of like forward. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, well, you know what's funny is, I, again, I disagree with you when the, and, and, but he kept going. So when your forward progress stops and, and they got him, it, it should be over. Some one of these days someone's gonna get hurt real bad in this and then they're gonna stop and change the rule. But until it happens, I just disagree. I see it in high school, I see it in college, I don't like it. I just don't like it. Score
I think he may have just heard some footsteps and just lost concentration. Thompson now in the quarterback. 
a good call. It's a good play call. something, 
So we got to be strong up front. I'd have everybody in the middle there just waiting and watching, making sure that we have a uh, linebacker on those uh, on those deep men and make the, the two wings, making sure that there's no funny stuff because they'll do a direct snap and number seven's back there. Those are the two running backs. Every night back to the turn. Everyone's at 38 yards. 643 left here for a goal. Snaps can skip off the ground, but no problem. They don't get the fun away. It's not a hand. It's going to have a goal. That's the big big strike. And it's not a hand. It's going to be down the yard. 629 left here. That's a big stain. Let's get first downs. Don't go for broke if you can right here. You got him down a little bit here. So let's be smart with passes. Let's go safe here. Got plenty of time. Just keep getting first downs. Two 
up here in this game. Yeah, I'll tell you what, that was wide open. He could have got some major yards. There's that tight end pop that me and Coach talked about before. We talked about the height and the tight ends and that. Yep. And we're actually at the lead on the right side this time. Almost the same thing for all intents and purposes. Yeah. There. Nobody can watch it. And that's exactly what you got.
36 left here in this game.
That's the second go. That's what we're doing. We're just going to take him out. Let's see. 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 Let's Personally, what I would do is put the ball right in the board. I'll tell you what, they'll they, 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 uh, they don't say crunch from, the, from about the three or whatever yard line they had it off. And uh, they had a heck of a run. So, I don't know. Really good at it. You're giving them good field position. I say punt it away. Thompson, that's going to 
Spike it at least, and again. Johnson now upfield. The big pitch gets to the outside. He's going to pitch off Johnson. It's going to go out of bounds at the 44 yard line. Too much time. Yeah, they should have spiked it. Should have spiked it. Somehow or another, we got some yards and have a clock to stop. Well, you have to get it down to at least uh, how many seconds? Let's say 35, 30 yard line. Yeah, Give him a shot. And stop the clock. And stop the clock. 16 seconds left here in this game. You gotta have everybody running up to you. Run. That pass is being thrown. You gotta run. You gotta tell her now. She's got Elisa. Run. So now in an empty back door. Trip the seals to the near side. Twist to the far side. 16 seconds left. Second down. Johnson back to pass. Gonna step up in the pocket under pressure. Forward pass is gonna be dropped by TJ Johnson. It might be the best thing that could have happened. Time to stop the clock in nine seconds. Left. A little Brett Favre okay. shuffle pass. <laughs> this is uh, interesting. We have a little check in. This is when you when you're growing up, you were in that field and a bunch of you were running around and this is what it looks like the big red. Johnson to check out for the Cobras. That's a real tie night. Nine seconds left here in this game. Fourth down, actually, for the Cobras. They've got 141 yard line. Got to throw something to the outside. Because I have a choice. Sideline, it should be. Boy, the end of Thompson, we're going to receive it to the far side. Thompson will come inside and be the one to the left. Thompson in an empty back for nine seconds left here in Lakewood. Good snap. Thompson back to pass. Looking downfield. Get, get going! Going to fire downfield. And it's going to go out of bounds. We're going to run out of real estate with two seconds left. And it's going to be a turnover on downs. And the Cobras will start their first defeat here in 2023. Opportunities for the Cobras, but just couldn't put together. Yeah. That's awesome. I'll tell you what. Skinny City game. Good football team. You know what? It's a fun game. Yeah. Actually, play. Uh, money's worth it. You pay to get in here. We have a little issue. Uh, uh, a long play. But I'll tell you what. Mm -hmm. Overall, clean game. Everything was good. Parody on the Cougar Pittsburgh teams, the Buckeye and Keystone Divisions, and the Tri Pro Football League. The Mountain Division in the West Virginia area is a little bit different. Two seconds left. There we go. This is easy. Just call it again. They need to call it again. Just call it.
belly fish was just, you know, if we had just one, just then. Thank you. 